Well, many of us are planning our Thanksgiving dinners, and that means Vermont specialty food producers are very busy these days. In fact, one small company in the Northeast Kingdom makes a pie every few commercial kitchens do, or makes a pie that very few commercial kitchens do these days. And as Jack Thurston tells us, these treats are made in Vermont. Connie's kitchen is actually an old two-car garage. Converted 16 years ago, when Connie Capusta decided to turn a lifelong love for baking into a business. It's my absolute goal to make everything homemade. She doesn't advertise, but folks in this part of the kingdom know her very well, or her products at least. Well, pies we're, we're known for, so we make literally every pie you could ever imagine. For Thanksgiving tables, that means at least a hundred pumpkin and apple pies. Also, a handful of old-time desserts few people eat these days. That's my first love of, of baking, it's old-fashioned baking. She makes mincemeat pies with real meat. Capusta uses beef, but some recipes call for venison during deer season, mixed with chopped apples, raisins, currants, molasses, and brandy. You just can't forget the brandy. The pies are a dense reminder of farmers' Thanksgiving and Christmas tables years ago. But the baker says the pies just aren't popular today, and she thinks people are missing out. They might be pleasantly surprised. Do you like apples, raisins, spices? Connie's Kitchen also makes the $16 pies without beef, and that's easier for most folks to swallow as a dessert. It has several ingredients you'd know from pumpkin pie. Um, cinnamon, nutmeg, allspice, uh, and some of the old-fashioned uh, cookbooks will call for mace, which you don't hear that much about today. The bakery usually only sells 10 or so mincemeat pies each holiday season. Other companies would just drop it as an offering since it's clearly no money maker. But not Connie Capusta. She sees herself as serving her neighbors tastes as varied as those may be. If they can think of it, she'll try to bake it. You know, some of them I have um, come to know as not just customers, but friends. So she'll be a part of so many Thanksgiving dinners, other than just her own, whether it's with her strong selling dinner rolls. I know it'll be over a hundred dozen. Or with these far less popular mincemeat pies. Connie Capusta is glad to be busy in her home bakery. You know, I feel very fortunate. And devoted to keeping the human touch a key ingredient in her made in Vermont treats. Jack Thurston, Channel 3 News in Hardwick. Connie Capusta said she may have started her own business a lot earlier, but she was devoted to her full-time job as a mother. You can find Connie's kitchen products at several stores from Craftsbury to Cambridge.